It is time for us to get smarter. Mm -hmm. Hell yeah. It's time for us to get better. It is time for us to learn about the big boys that make it all happen. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time to go in the trenches with A.Q. Shipley. A.Q. Here, Here we go, boys. Hey, what a year this has been. This has been awesome. I hope you guys have enjoyed it as much as I have. Because it's, it's literally the best day of my week. I love coming here, getting a little break from reality, and oh, just yeah. talking oh. a little ball with y'all. No, I've oh, seen right. photos. You're a good dad, a good I husband. Know, Those it's are nice good. to get a little break. Yeah, well, okay. Yeah, I, I nice understand. Nice to get a little break. It's been nice to learn some ball from your brain this year, yeah. AQ. What right. do we got here? Uh, so we're going to watch this guy right here because he's unbelievable. Let's just watch this Let's just let this go a little bit. We're going we're gonna to talk through this one, right? <laughs> Creed Humphreys. Yep. Oh, now check this out. Did you see what he just did right there? A mm -hmm. little shuffle. Okay. Now they sell zone this way. Mm -hmm. Now here's what's huge right here. They're selling zone. This is complete play action. This is one of the biggest plays in the game. This is the first deep ball that he hits, right? This guy can come underneath the tight end right here and affect this and make this play. But this is some of the stuff we saw from the Falcons all year, right? We saw where you get the center selling one way and then coming back. Now this is where it gets huge. Right here. Ooh. See him making – he's got he can make an impression on this play. But now Creed comes, seals it up, gets him outside, and then we go with the deep ball. Jeez, 31. And yeah, he got lost. He just, just, lost gotta, he gotta he just got lost. Got to track the ball. But that was the first big play in this game. That's a Huge. sweet design. Sweet design, right? And I think based on it, now if he had a guy front side here, it would be this guy doing it, right? Like no matter what, it's always whoever the uncovered guy is just happens to be your all pro. Shuts him down inside, gets him around the corner, gives him all the Before time. the snap, are they uh, saying anything, saying, like, it's me, or is it just understood? So, typically the way it's installed is they're faking the zone to the right. So, whenever you step right, whoever is uncovered to their right is the guy who would be doing this. You saw New England do this for years, oh, yeah. where the guy, they call it a whirly bird, right? So, you come here, fake here, and then you come back and seal the backside. They're just doing it. A different way. So there's not a conversation up. before snap where Creed's like, me, me, me. Nope. And he might say it just to echo it, right? But it's installed this way. It, Uncovered guy, go seal the edge. Now is Noah Gray inviting him inside? Probably. Probably. I think the biggest he thing that can... down there. He motioned out there to get some leverage on FUC. Or yep. to move to there. First down, too, around the alumni section. Let's see? Yep. Uh, let, me there. Little, let me get a better leverage on this thing and invite That's him right. right in there. Yep. Comes back outside leverage right here. Right, let's just slow it down. Let him get there and then Creed help out. So it's outside shoulder. That's so it. So the pack can get outside. Bingo. And huck it. Because wow. he wanted to break and It's all so planned. Yep. Mm -hmm. Everything's so planned. It would awesome. suck to play defense. Yeah, it does. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Now let's watch this. By the way, Kinlaw, first time all year where I thought he had an awesome. I mean, he's been kind of talked about. He was a first round pick. They were expecting big things out of him. Has not played all year. He had a great game, but on this particular play, we're running a single with an insert here. Look at this. Uh, his hold. He picked up his leg. He, uh, we just, uh, actually, that was what? a spine buster. Literally right? lift him off the ground and then bury. He should have said, if you oh, yeah, that, he looks like he's doing a rock doing hey, a spine that's buster. That's a flag. No holding. Wow. They, don't get, they don't get holdings wow. in the Super Bowls. That's the double team committed. And not that's calling, the double huh? team committed. And then look at him. He's off the ground. He's got two feet off the ground. Yeah, he's picking yeah, he got up. lifted up. Yeah. That's leverage. I mean, that's a spine bust. That's an actual spine yeah. buster. That, that, that is a Arne spine Anderson, buster. Arne Anderson. Boom. Triple H. I mean, the a, Rock. What? Pretty awesome. Al Gray. Yeah. Is that who that was? Yeah. Al Gray. He had a torn UCL, they said, mm -hmm. most of that game. Yeah. And AQ had something to say about that, too. What'd you say? What do you mean? I'm just saying a lot of guys get torn UCLs. That's why the elbow braces are everywhere. Oh, you're saying pretty standard operating procedure. But tough nonetheless. Yeah, yeah, certainly. Yeah. Tough nonetheless. Yeah, it, you're not taking away from Al Gretti. You're just no, saying no. this is much more common than people much think. Much more common. Ryan Jensen had it. Uh, well, I think Brendel for the 49ers, I think, played most of the year with it. A lot of guys have it. Got it, it but still a tough guy. Still oh, yeah. tough guy. This play, I think we've all seen. Tough, tough ending for my man, Coach Wilkes, here at the end. But Creed Humphrey, look at this. Look how fast this is. AJ, look how fast this is when you watch this. A center reaching... Fred Warner, who's one of the fastest linebackers in football, getting to the front side here. Ooh. Now watch this. Boom. Now watch this. Watch him stay connected for another 35 yards. <laughs> Throw him into the defensive coordinator. Oh, geez, that's Steve Wilkes right there. Damn. Damn. Oh, that's tough. That's, that's awesome. Wilkes. Oh, no. Maybe that's yeah. when they were like, all right. Not doing this anymore. That's it. Steve, you didn't even help him up. Look how fast Creed is. is it, I mean, this is unbelievable. He makes contact with him in between the hash and the hey, numbers. So Creed's phenomenal. He's unbelievable. Yeah. What happened with the snaps? 
Sometimes you get a little bit of the yips, and you don't even realize it. Like I said, we've had this conversation so many times. Like, you don't even realize. It's the same thing. Like, you think in, in the golfer's world, it only happens in the golfer's world. Some mental block happens when you're chipping in golf or in the snap game. And punning, then, kicking, throwing. Punning, kicking. Something, some mental block happens, and Should then cover. everything's low, and you think it's good, but then now it's in your head. So now every time afterwards, you're walking back to the hole. Hey, Pat, where was the snap? He can get over that, though. He'll get over Maybe it. That, that was a good one. Mm -hmm. Would that be that was why one. Pat wouldn't say something? Because it's like, hey, if I tell this guy these are a little low, he might just sell one over my head, and that'd be way worse. Yeah, you might. Yeah, because then you overcompensate, yeah. right? You overcompensate the low with the super high one. And now it's twenty yards. Yeah, going the other AJ, way. AJ, get off the block, dude. He like look how fast he is out though, and he's eyeballing Fred from the, you, like Fred feels it. Like Fred's on his horse. He takes off. Yeah, he's but, like you can't than do the other. a whole lot here with that. Like with his leverage and look how his body control. That's incredible. Man. That's incredible. And staying on it. Creed's a guy. Yeah, yeah. he's a guy. I mean, that's incredible. Only cost them $1.3 million. Okay. This year. Okay. Here we go. He's we got <laughs> rookie contract. Rookie yeah. contract still. Jeez. Same with Trey Smith. So huge. This is, this is two plays in a row here. We got two of the biggest plays. Pause this real quick. Yeah, and you're going to see it a little bit more from D Butts when he talks about it more from the wide view. But so just hear me out here, right? We got Kittle and two receivers out here to the right, two receivers out there to the left. So as you're what seeing. What play is this? So this is the last play of the game in overtime, right? And this is the one where we're going to leave Chris Jones completely unblocked. He's already said it was his fault. There's been a ton of conversation on the internet about it. Oh, it is God. what it is, right? So he reacts, sees him, right? They both go down. But here's the deal. That's the Will linebacker. They're obviously running a play action down to the Will, down here, center there. He should be man. He should be man out here. You're hot off here. If there's anything, it's got to be a sift. But we cannot leave this guy unblocked. He goes out. He goes down. You got the best defense, one of the best defensive tackles in football oh. coming scot-free. Biggest play of the game. Needed to get it. He was wide open on the whip route. Ayuk on the other side, wide open, coming across right around in there. Two options if you get this blocked up. Hey, if they get this blocked up, you think Steve Wilkes fired today? A lot of consequences from... There's this play and the next play. Well, Pat, tomorrow. Pat probably still goes down and gets a touchdown and scores two. Probably. probably. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but do we know if the Niners are going for two? Yeah, it sounds like they didn't even they, know. They, <laughs> they, they, they <laughs> thought it was over. They scored a touchdown. They're Kyle the Shanahan's headset's off. Yeah, 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 they're putting. What's that? You still there's got no a, way they go for two. Could you imagine Kyle Shanahan has his headset, throws his headset whenever they score a touchdown? Oh, Big so Gatorade, Gatorade bath. bath. Yeah. Yep. The whole thing <laughs> happened. It's over. You know what's next? This is over. They game. Now you backed up. Can you yep. kick the extra point? Now you what are you gotta, talking about? Uh, late game, buddy. They yeah. get the ball. <laughs> Who does? What? The Chiefs. Since no. when? Two years ago. What? <laughs> Was anybody going to tell us? Well, you're the one that's supposed to. Yeah. That would have been bananas. Oh, yeah. That would have been so awesome. Oh, man. If they score a touchdown on this play and Kyle Shanahan throws the headset, throws the play call. Sprints to person. We were robbed. Finally. Finally. Did it. Gatorade, like probably three Gatorade baths happened. John Lynch sprinting down the steps from the suite. Oh, my God. Like Tony Romo. Bat. Tony Romo going crazy. Hey, did it, Jim? You know, the whole. <laughs> oh, he's, he's definitely questioning himself. Yeah, because he's just like, yeah, I love it. Obviously, gosh, he's not going to celebrate if he doesn't know. And then they got to get off the field. I love it. Do you think they're going for two there? No, I guess they're no, just no, kicking they're the extra point. They're just extra point. Because that's a 38 yarder. They're, they're off to the tunnel. That's why I like the, the, the conversation. Over. Like, well, they might have, you know, San Fran might have done it differently because the Chiefs are going for two. San Fran didn't fucking know that. No. It's no. not like, they're, they're off the, they're in the tunnel. Yeah. They, they oh. no Where's idea. the confetti? Kyle Shanahan's asking. <laughs> I, I was told that if we win this thing, that's insane to think about. But all of it obviously comes down to shit like this yep. that you don't even really talk about. That's an insane play right there. Yeah, the big thing is, like like we talked about it, and we're going to talk about it on this one too, right? Like, it, it's you got your two best plays called for the two biggest moments in the thing, and you get you get lapses, whether it's, whether it's a protection call or whether it's a guard going down in the last one. On this one, again, I don't know if you noticed this when you were paying attention to this, right? They only got two D linemen in the game. Mm -hmm. Two D linemen, two linebackers, seven DBs. They're in dime coverage. Right, so you know Spags is going to come with cover zero. When he comes with cover zero or some form of it, in this case, it's really not. They're just bringing six. But here's the deal: as an offensive line, we treat this as down, 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 down. So you got your four down. Now you got to find who we're sliding to. If when you see the wide view, you'll see it. And when we talk about cap, you'll see there's a receiver right here with a DB over him, and then a safety behind him. We call that capped. That tells the center and the quarterback. 
he can come on a blitz. Well, check this out. We got Kittle in protection over here. With Kittle in protection over here, leave him for the, for the pressure guy who's coming from over here. That allows us to then slide left. Send him to there, him to there. Now 65 can block Trent McDuffie, and Trent stays wide. If that were the case, we pick this whole thing up. Purdy has all the time in the world. Instead, we send him this way, two for one over here with Kittle, and we get a free and we get a free runner up the thing up, mm -hmm. up the B Bolton gap. Bolton his face too. Think about AQ. Look at Bolton crosses his face too. Like sets him up outside, cross the face to open that. Open gap the window, and then this guy stays wide to get the to get the window. Question AQ. Yes. Now, is there in any world is Kittle supposed to look backside there, and a, would a running back who's used to that more yes. been better in that situation? Mm, good question. Uh, uh, so you so check, so AQ. typically. Good question. Typically, you're, they're going to treat this guy, if this was the protection I think it is, where we're sliding Mike to Sam or whatever, then you would leave him will to anything weak, then back across, if anything. That's a lot of shit going on, right? Mm -hmm. At the end of the day, if we just if we just leave him for him and slide left, mm -hmm. we don't even have to talk about this. But like, a lot of shit going on. A lot of the times, don't running backs not know? And like... Wouldn't a running back in that situation step up and like realize immediately? I don't and it, know. Granted, it's split second. Yeah, timed it's, it up perfect though. McDuffie timed second, up yeah. perfect yeah. on the run. But like in this little quick, li like even when you just start it. The, well, in his the eyes, split like second of it. Like he's thinking he's got the will. Yeah. Yes. No. So no. That's no, the I, will, right? Yeah. No, I get that. But like in the split second where he sees, hey, seventy four's got him. Like, is there any thought it's that... It's all reaction. It's yeah. all feel. And it, yeah, I mean... It's it just, it'd be hard for Kittle to be back. How often do we see Kittle in the backfield not running a route on exactly. must have really it down? Because all they were trying to do is get CMC right here on this yeah. little shake route. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that was Which it. Which yeah. Shanahan was Christian, Christian, Christian yep. in the mic up. Yeah, but just didn't have the time. Like, because boom. by the time he gets open like right here... real quick split second. I'm, I'm not saying it's easy, He's obviously. There there. I'm just sure. saying. Sure, I just think in the two biggest moments of the game, you know Spags is bringing pressure, which he did. Mm-hmm. You gotta have an answer for it. You gotta have an answer. It was timed perfectly too. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's just perfect timing. Like we also, knew in the McDuffie, Super Bowl. Go ahead. AJ. Think about McDuffie not getting a hands to the face call. That was an unbelievable job by him. Not like, oh, it was yeah. a very easy one where you could you could just ooh, accidentally brush the face mask. Boom, penalty. He did a good job of not doing that. Hey, that was the Super Bowls. Yeah, oh, yeah. That was the Super Bowls. Bowls. Couple good plays, couple bad plays. Mm -hmm. Couple, what are we doing? What are we not doing? Yeah. Yeah. Now, what do we got? Be best big bumps of the whole yeah, season. Yeah, I picked I pick four oh. that I that I liked. I picked four from the season that I thought were some of the best. The first one was Week One. We remember this we guy? Yeah, remember oh, him. He's no, quarterback really. for the Browns. Oh, yeah. Wow. Yeah. You yeah. remember that? Yeah. yeah. That's crazy. How about this guy? Yeah, I was going to say. Yeah, I was going to say. How about this guy? Yeah. Yeah. He's really good. I think they're entire. I, I think they're entire O line too. I was gonna say who's that right tackle? We got a, we got a full group O lineman up there. Isn't it crazy how from week one to week seventeen it's a whole different team? A little we know this guy was gonna burn his face yep. and then still play. Oh yeah, Pro Bowl <laughs> makes Pro Bowl. Jeez, hey, good for you and Joku. You have no idea the ride you're about to go on. This Shout out week show. one. That's Shout out week one. Shout out week one. And we get, week we one. get Wyatt Teller, who we talked about all year long, right? We remember this play. Boom, we get the little fit. I don't remember this play. Okay, nope. well, you're going to remember when he buries the guy down here off the screen, 25 <laughs> oh, yeah. yards downfield. Keep running. Oh, Keep yeah. running. Oh, I Keep do running. remember this play. Keep Holding. running. Oh, Keep oh, running. I do remember this play. Yeah. That was not a one. That was just good blocking, yeah. good leverage. Yeah, blocking block. hands yeah, inside. Pretty good. Pretty good. <laughs> I think his wife retweeted this, right? I think. She did. Yes. Okay, yep. because Wyatt Teller does not get enough love, yep. and you've tried. This dude's dog. Dog. I mean, he was he was in the but, trade with uh, with just yeah. or Jordan Poyer. 15. To Buffalo. Man. So that was like almost an even trade. It was Wyatt Teller basically for Jordan Poyer. 25 yards. Both teams win. That is a long <laughs> no. way to move another man. It's incredible. And these are the plays I love. Like, I love the effort plays. Like, it was the Linderbaum versus Devin White a couple years ago. And it's, I mean, it's just the effort plays. And then that is awesome. <laughs> the finish. Yep. Let's go to Tampa Bay. Ooh. Tristan Wirfs coming down on Denzel Perriman. I just heard Ty Schmidt go. Go Hawks. Go Hawks. Yeah. Go Kirk's Hawks. dogs. Kirk's dogs. Go Hawks. We get a nice little flat route. He's actually short on the aiming point. It gets behind him. But because he's 6'6", 350 pounds, and strong as a fucking oh, ox. Oh, yeah. Jesus. I remember that one. Oh, no. oh Get boy. Oh, yep. I recall. Oh, boy. Oh, he's too big. He's too way, big and fast. Too I strong, mean, too big, too fast. And again, we talked about this whenever I showed this earlier in the year. He's a banger yeah. at linebacker. Perriman's a banger. Got suspended for a few yeah, games. Yeah. Yeah. That, if oh, I boy. Yeah. yeah. So we get him out the club. Gotta Jason love this one. Kelsey. Gotta love this one. Is it overtime? Absolutely. This is the overtime play. Absolutely. Yeah. Stud, right? This was a play they needed to have, right? Everybody thought Buffalo. Nope. 
We got this. We get we get the check versus cover oh, zero. Perfect. There it is. Perfect play call. Perfect ear hole shot on the blitz. Oh, I got him. Nope. See oh, you he later. killed that guy. Yep. You're go nine nine. Todd, game over. I think that was the last game the Bills lost until the playoffs. Obviously, the, I mean, that uh, might have been the last game the Eagles won. I think. Yeah. Se- I think second, yeah. <laughs> they only had one more after this. That team fell, fell apart. Lost six straight. We got a new OC in Philly. We're going to see if uh, Kellen Moore. Yep. Yeah, Kellen, Kellen Moore. Moore. New DC too. How do we feel about that? I mean, they I like got Kellen. legit. They have everything. I mean, like they have. Jalen but aren't Hurts. they a run? Aren't they set up to be a good running team? But, is Kellen? Yeah, and all he cares about is putting points up on board. Kellen was down in Dallas when they had that little two-headed monster with Zeke and Tony. They, they ran yeah, very Tony. well. They can. They I ran. mean, Tony has no idea we're talking about him right now. He'll find us out a no few clue. weeks from now, but. <laughs> <laughs> Tony's a dog. And then things didn't go so well this year with Eckler in that running game, but, I mean, that was just a disaster mess. Yeah. Devonta Smith, Dallas Goddard, A.J. Brown, I think Kellen Moore is going to have a good time. How to use Yeah, him. I do too. I think he's got all the weapons, and he'll be able to be creative with them. You love this guy. He's got dreads. He's a white dude. That's exactly right. Quinn Miners, I love him. I love him. I love him. And I think play, like defensive play, defensive play callers and defensive coaches, period, hate going against this guy because this is what he's trying to do on every play. Again, we get a light box because they had some linebacker issues. We get him up here. Oh, oh yeah. boy. Oh, oh no. Jesus. Oh, what a oh, prick. Boy. AJ, what happened? Oh, boy. Well, he didn't jump on him when he was down, so I, I would appreciate that if they did this to me. He could have he could have pile drove him right in the ground. After he's this. got plenty of clips doing that, so, yeah, you're right. I mean, yeah, he, he, I took this, he took Look, this one off. He was happy oh, with his result. Loaf? Gets a pancake, <laughs> gets a loaf. <laughs> I mean, that Look, is super impressive. Broncos beat the Bills here. Too. Remember that they game? Did. They did. Yeah. Russell Wilson quarterback. So those were my favorites. Those were my favorites That's from cool. the year. Hey, yeah, thank yeah, you. AQ. That's Here we go. Thank you, Baby AQ.